In the times of Moses and Joshua, the men of Israel saw many magnificent structures and idols dedicated to the Nephilim gods, the fallen angels, their culture, and the pride and demonic culture created by the father of lies, the prince of the air, Lucifer. As some of the Israeli men were tempted to worship the false gods of the heathen tribes, there were men like Joshua and Moses and Abraham who took a stand for the most high God, Yahweh, the creator of heaven and earth. Joshua, Moses, and Abraham were the men who God considered his friends. Moses had the privilege of meeting the pre-incarnate Christ as the great I Am in the burning bush. Abraham met the pre-incarnate Christ through king and priest Melchizedek. Abraham received a visit from the pre-incarnate Christ along with two angels prior to the destruction of Sodom and Gomorrah. Joshua met the pre-incarnate Christ right before the Battle of Jericho to take over the Holy Land back from the Amorites and the Canaanite Nephilim race of evil sons of fallen Lucifer. Jesus appeared to Joshua as the captain of God's army. Joshua literally was at ease and decided to dine in the presence of the enemy before the great battle. You can be a friend of God and receive special privileges from Jesus Christ by putting on the whole armor of God as mentioned in the book of Ephesians chapter 6 verse 11. When we put on our spiritual armor according to our faith in the Lord Jesus Christ, we too will enter Jerusalem as saints in the near future. You and I can be part of the special 1000 years reign of Jesus Christ on the earth. Joy to the world, the Lord has come. May the earth receive its King.